guys, it's me, Miss Reaper, and I'm just going to say hello to the guys that I'm playing with. Good morning, gamers. Yes. Um, I'm just waiting on this dungeon to load in. Um, but we are doing the Lost City of Amdapur hard. This dungeon is absolutely gorgeous, in my opinion. It's a shame it's raining. Hmm. And there we are. Oh, I like that robe. But, um, I think it's the healer. Yes, it is the healer. I love that... That robe. That's the healer in me talking, by the way. Hi, I'm not gonna pull for you. I just played, um... Dragoon. For Sir Emmerich and whatnot. Yes, guys, I literally, like, do a bunch of my videos, like, on the same day. Um, so yeah. It basically allows me to keep up to date with my uploads. Because like if I do, you know, them on the day, I'm like, ee, ooh, no. So keep myself, you know, a little bit on track ahead of schedule and I'm fine uh, let's do a bit of throwing oh we don't want to step into that that could do a hell of a lot of damage hi we don't give me misery I don't want misery I got rid of misery. I'm fine. I'm okay. Jump out of that. No. It's been a while since I actually played um, Ninja. Last time I played Ninja was the last video that I made as Ninja. Because I've been focusing on leveling up a bunch of other classes. Yeah. Plus as well the fact that it is now level 80 which means I don't have to focus on it until all of my other classes are 82. Which won't be long but you know. Let's hurt some of these butterfly looking things. Me think. One, I've got two more. There we go. They're all gone now. Okay, first boss, which is an Akama. I'll do my little combo, I think. stopped raining oh yes we have casted like images of ourselves which like I don't know if like they're wanting to help us fight or if they're like trying to just kill us but I think it will be that they're trying to kill us And there they are again. Oh. Just like, you know, jumping out of the way. Oh, I am being targeted. By this, like, cloud thing. Which I suppose I have to let touch me. Ugh. 
I got vulnerability one. Which is like a minute effect of just, if something hits me, it hits me for a little bit more than what it usually does. Yeesh. Which is fine, as long as you don't get to like vulnerability 16, which is like the highest that I've seen. And that's mainly on tanks in trials and alliance raids. I think the highest I've got is like vulnerability 4. So yeah. Vulnerability 4 is my highest. Oh, it's this dungeon. Wait, is it this dungeon? Have we already done Diablos in the Doors? I think we have. But me going, I don't remember. It's early morning. Okay, I haven't had my coffee yet. And the walkway has opened up. Right, I'm going to go open up this little coffer. Roll for all of the loot. Of course, some good rolls, some bad rolls. Pick a number between 1 and 99, okay? That, that's your roll. It's like you're playing D&D &D, but with a 99 dice. More chances of rolling poorly, but then there's always the odd chance that you might just get the 99. Okay, and there's a little treasure coffer to our right as soon as we enter this podium, so grab that. Right, and while I am like massively knowing where my keys are on my keyboard, I'm just gonna press those. Don't you push me back, you rift dragon. I will mandra you. I think that's what they're called, I know. Wait, mudra. They're called mudras. Not whatever I've just said. <laughs> I'm just aiming for this buttocks. Because why not? Oh yeah, it's this one. Look! I had this as a mount! I have this as a mount! But this one's called the winged lion, not the given whatever that was. Okay, so we see these like sound wave things. I believe that's a stay away from them. Oops. Get rid of the arcane sphere. Oh, it's growing. Oh, back away. Just, just a little bit. Alright, let's do a, all three of them. And splash them with a bit of water. Still five. Earth resistance down two. For four minutes. Ooh, but we've all got that. Yowch. Okay. So if, I guess if you step into those, you get the next thing because it says here, wind resistance. Let's get these guys down next. And then we can get the sphere, which I'm just going to work on. There we are. 
Um, just keep fighting this lion. He's at 30... 29 percent. Okay, I've now got wind resistance instead of earth. Oh, that's not going to help me out when I've got an aero attack to just come on me like <laughs> I'm just stabbing this. Because why not? Ah, uh, yes, Thancred would have a field day with you. Just roll for this stuff. Proceed to the next area. You just gotta press the statue and you get teleported. Ooh, loot. Okay. Oh yes, yes, yes. There's nothing, uh, you know, obviously bad about this. Stuff isn't definitely not going to turn into enemies that we can fight. Hmm. Right. Uh, step out a little bit. And we have two more because there's that little light sprite right here right. the only thing that's down here is a copper which we're all running for leaving the poor tank just running off by themselves oh poor tank i rolled a two okay now there's little bucks now i think the machinists have been hard at work we need machines. Oh. We don't want to be in the overlapping area. That's more damage. Can you just see all my little knives that I've been throwing on the floor just like scatter? Just on the floor minding their own business. I don't believe there's anything up those stairs, so just proceed downwards. Okay. And even more machines have appeared. Mang. Mang. Mag. Manapop. <laughs> I want to say manga pop, but I'm like, hold up, there's no G. Stop. Here's me going, I can't basic English. <laughs> Oh, let's look away from all of that. Ha ha ha. Oh, oh. Best thing is, I can still cast stuff while not looking at anything. Okay, little bit of cutscene. Basically, just. We have stairs and a door. And this thing, made of stone. And people in the comments are gonna go, hold up, this is showing us a bit of storm blood. I'm aware. I keep forgetting this is a Heaven Sword dungeon, not a Shadowbringers dungeon. I'm not the only one running this. Well, at least they're waiting for us. Aww. I feel so honored. Yay. I should really cast my mandra before I fight. But. I think that because I've been playing so much Dancer recently, casting my steps does damage. So I just get used to getting up close and personal when I do my steps. Oh, where'd you go? So I'm questioning if I should be in or out of this. Oh, 
Okay. I messed up the. There we go. So this is on a timer. Oh no, I'm bleeding! Get out of there! So I can stop the bleeding. Uh oh. Bombs away! Ninja jump for the ween! Just get to the other side with ninja jump. It works wonders. That ninja jump it has got me out of some sticky situations. Oh. Let's um, go over here, let me think. Okay. So yeah, her cure. Or it's cure, should I say. Um, does damage. Also, I think this does a roll of three. So basically you kill it three times and then you're done. Just in case anyone in the comments goes, hold up, that thing gone down twice already. What do you mean it's not dead? Oh yes, that's a stay outside. Casting cure four? IV four. I'm not good with my Roman numerals, okay? Now remember this is this is fourteen which is X I V. Sixteen is X V I. I am yet to actually play Final Fantasy sixteen, but I've heard good things about it. So I'm looking forward to playing it. Low Putu. Okay. Get rid of the ad. Don't let it hit our friend. Okay, and there we are. I'm afraid to return back to stone. Hey guys, um, thank you for the battle. Apparently I don't want to do my V pose. And there we go. So guys, if you like that video, don't forget to like comment and subscribe, stay safe, explore Eorzea, and peace out!